we get pretty happy to see generational upgrades to devices we review every year. Uh, one of them happens to be the ROG Strix SCAR series. Quite the looker, not a joke when it comes to performance. And despite the usual specs bump we get from generational upgrades, the ROG Strix SCAR 16 has some other improvements that could potentially replace your laptop. Let's talk all about it in this video. Let's begin. Now let's quickly talk about the performance. The ROG Strix Car 16 is not joking around when it comes to performance. The variant we have here comes back with the latest 13th generation Intel Core i9-3980HX processor. Why? It's about bullied it. The ROG Strix Car 16 has more CPU cores than my desktop and my laptop combined and it can be overclocked if you need more power for any kind of reason. Uh, be it for work or for play. But long story short, it is a very capable processor for both work and play, and the GPU that it comes with is as powerful as the processor, and what you find under the hood is an RTX 4080. With the 65 watt on CPU, 175 watt TGP on the GPU, and with the advanced optimus, this thing slaps and adapts to any kind of situation. Hardware like this require a good thermal solution and uh, Asus did not skimp on that because we find a triple fan setup with seven heat pipes helping with the heat dissipation and most importantly, the liquid metal conductor knot extreme. It handles things very well. And uh, here are some of the quick metrics on the performance from this laptop. Now let's talk about improvements. With the recent trends, many laptops are embracing the 16 by 10 aspect ratio, which gives users more vertical real estate to maximize their display experience. This also means that you get a bigger display and in ROG's case, in the same form factor. This time, the ROG Strix car has two dimensions available. You have the 16 inch and the 18 inch. Both display hits about 90% screen to body ratio with the thin bezels and giving immersive display. But it just doesn't end there. For the first time in a long time, we finally see better displays on a gaming laptop. The ROG Strix K16 has one of the best displays I've ever seen in a long time, and it's the ROG Nebula HDR display, which uses mini LED backlighting. Just like how Asus OLED has some strict guidelines uh, for their display, it's pretty much the same here too, with three factors in mind. That is being fast, bright, and vivid. This particular display we see with the ROG Strix car specifically offers a 10-bit color depth with 100% DCI-P3 color support that's Pantone validated, 240 hertz with 3 millisecond response time, hitting up to 1,100 nits peak brightness and even has support for Dolby Vision that gives better entertainment experience. You're getting a creme de la creme display on this ROG Strix car 16 because I found myself lost in this display with its beautiful color, even when playing Starfield. Oh yeah, on top of that, we finally get the webcam back too. So none of that finding for an external webcam. So it's right now built right into the laptop itself. Other than that, we get some nicer design cues all over, such as better looking RGB setup, more thoughtfully designed LED indicators, the number pad on the trackpad with ROG font and in white backlight, and no more worrying about losing the keystone as they have removed it completely. Now, truth be told, in the past, we have seen some ROG Strix car laptops with improvements for sure. And I say that because being consistent is extremely important to make better products, which brings me to the point of how glad I am to say that the ROG Strix Car 16 has improved by a lot from the first car that I knew, and now with better hardware, impressive experience, and at a cool 13,999 ringgit, this is a feisty laptop you cannot get enough of. Well, you can also check out the review on the ROG Strix Car 16 once it's up on our site, so stay tuned for that. And thank you so much for watching this video. We will catch you guys in a really, really cool tech video in the future very, very soon. Until then, this is Pretty Right signing off. Take care, and I'll see you guys real soon. Bye.